Friday. On the docket today, I have a triple. So it's all just easy stuff. Um, and I have a, a swim reservation at 7.30 p.m. Unfortunately, that was the only time I could get. So that's gonna be last. Um, and then I have a run oh, and a bike. Oh, hey. Sometime before then, um, and I'm going to document every single thing that I eat today and uh, count calories because I really have no idea. People ask me what I eat in a day, and um, today is the day we find out. But of course, first things first. So these are actually beans that I roasted a couple days ago. Um, this is the second batch. First batch was really bad. This batch I'm feeling a lot better about, so let's give her a whirl. Much better than the first one. I think Annie wants some Spro. Those of you who follow the channel know that I start almost every day with a Kodiak cake. Uh, it's my breakfast of choice. The secret is I add oats and I started adding cacao nibs because Colin bought them. So it's the Mayan superfood. I've been using coconut oil to lube up the pan these days. Um, probably not quite two tablespoons, so we'll, we'll call that about 200 calories worth. Got about two tablespoons of butter, about 200 calories just to top off that pancake. Gotta make sure we get all that coconut oil soaked in there too. Just down in an 1150 calorie breakfast right here. Spro number two. All right, we're out here at La Cueva High School. Um, I've just got a 40 minute run and then six by 150 sprints with full rest. Uh, I brought the GoPro, but I forgot the SD card, so f me. But um, Will's here filming the Brooks workout, so I'm wondering if I get my uh, done fast enough if I can get some footage of these strides. So maybe strides footage, maybe not. You'll find out in the next clip. All right, so uh, about 650 calories burned on that run in 150s. About to add 200 more to the total on the day. Take one of these big bars. Got a little sandy in the works between, uh, so arugula's basically have no calories, between the Parmesan dressing, butter, turkey, bacon, bread, and this egg over here. It'll be just over 700 calories, about 710. Give or take. There she is. Ooh, perfect yolk. GoPro's dead, so uh, no actual bike footage, but I stumbled upon this really awesome little uh, place, National Monument on the western edge of Albuquerque, the uh, Petroglyph National Monument. Beautiful view of the Sandias, and this came from all the way down there. This ride is gonna be like an uh, hour and a half to two hours. And as far as fueling goes, I have each of these 710 milliliters of heed, um, which has 110 calories in each bottle. So it's 220 total. And I have another one of those 200 calorie fig bars. So I'll aim to have all of this drank and that fig bar eaten uh, by the end of this ride. Woo. First bottle down. I uh, didn't plan out this loop very well. I'm actually not sure how long it's gonna be. Could very well be over two hours, but I mean, fueling won't be a huge issue. I think I uh, overcompensated a bit with um, the electrolyte carb mix and 
in uh, both water bottles plus this big bar. So, I mean, I'll be fine if it's too long. Um, just gotta be careful tomorrow if I'm too tired. But Christ, this is beautiful. There's, there's like absolutely nothing out here. Sweet clouds. Just love to see that beautiful empty road. All right, so uh, finished up that ride. The loop actually was not too long, um, just under two hours, uh, 1400 calories burned. And again, uh, 110 in each of those bottles, which I finished and 200 in that fig bar. Uh, and so now it's 3.30, I have four hours until my swim reservation. So that's enough time to actually get in a, a good meal, um, decent amount of calories, because I'm not gonna be able to eat like all that much when I get back at almost nine. So now is a good time to pack in a, a good percentage of the calories for the day. All right, two ounces of turkey jerky, so uh, 160 calories. I already gave you some. I already gave you some, you mother mm -hmm. Fine, you get a bit more. This is not from my allotted two ounces, so the calories still being counted are, are correct. And up. Oh. Good boy. Good boy. One of my favorite meals is a sort of a grain salad bowl like this. I'm kind of assuming the arugula has no calories. Got a cup of rice in there, which is 200. Three of these chicken apple sausages, which are 160 each. Three ounces of carrots. Um, bell pepper, some Parmesan, and two different types of dressings, wasabi ginger and uh, lemon basil vinaigrette. So all in all, this salad grain bowl thing is uh, 910 calories. So let's go put her down. Clean ball club, put her down. Third and final spro for the day. Bit of a short count, but you know, a lot of training to fit in. Can't get as many spros. Chicks over there. Well, the game's not too good. All right, we're here at Sandia High School. We got an hour, we got a lane reserved. Last session of the day. Let's knock this out and then eat a bunch more and then this video's done. Oh my god. Alright. Uh, swim complete. Exercise for the day complete. Taking in some protein. This is 140 calories right here. And then um, I think I'm gonna head to Chipotle. Uh, swim actually felt good today. It just started to make a little bit more sense, I guess. A long way to go is an understatement, but um, it's just already a step up from last week, which is great, so. The promised land. So I get um, double brown rice, double black beans, fajitas, uh, double meat split between steak and carnitas, and pico and lettuce. And according to a quick Chipotle calorie calculator online, this is 1100 calories. Let's get down to it. The, uh, the sessions of the day just hit me like a brick wall, but uh, put her down. I'm like, not full yet. Gotta go for dessert. I have one of these uh, protein cookies. Go chocolate chip tonight. Eight grams of protein. 210 calories. So for second dessert, I'm having this stroop waffle. It's 140 calories. Mm -hmm.